Hi, my name is Bruce from the Missouri Kansas City Division. Welcome to this edition of Kickball 101. Today, we're going to talk about the strike zone. All right, let's start with the basics. Your strike zone is basically a foot on either side of home plate, as well as a foot above home plate. That's a little bit bigger than your standard walk a kickball, but you can use it as a guide to sort of see where that strike zone would be. So there you go. Basically, if a ball crosses into any, one, any part of this territory, a foot on either side of the plate, it's going to be considered a strike. The tricky part is the vertical thing. Well, the strike zone, as far as vertically, it extends up to about right here, uh, roughly about a foot above the plate. The bottom of the ball has to come into this zone, otherwise it's a ball. We have a rule against bouncing, so what's a bouncing? It's when a ball goes over the one foot line, uh, when it comes into the batter's box and, uh, before it's last bounce into home plate. Uh, if it goes over the one foot line at the plate, it's a bouncing. Lastly, if it goes over the one foot line past the plate, but before it reaches a kicker, that's also considered a bouncing. Bouncy pitches are balls. We'll talk about more of that later on in the season. Thank you for watching this edition of Kickball 101.